you know, defense and put action plan, yeah? How to use AI, solve each part of the problem, okay? So, this is a typical, interesting problem. Um, you, you may consider, I believe bodyguard, bodyguard business eventually will be digital tree, okay? For example, this is a YVR airport, yeah? So right now, the, the physical airport, you know, and um, the airplane, the restaurant, the, the security services, right, the regular food services, right, this is service system, yeah? And uh, now, because of technology, right, with IoT AI, right, you should have a digital free version of your airport, okay? So if you build up the nice map about the, uh, you know, Vancouver Airport, and uh, there is a running by themselves, uh, 7 by 24, right? You can monitor each of the airplane and uh, use camera uh, sensor and see that schedule, which one is uh, delayed, which one is uh, on time, and then have me inform to the, the passengers. And um, uh, same thing for the food, for uh, other services, right? It should be uh, in a digital right? You use a, basically, you collect all the information, you have a virtual airport, which you can put on your mobile phone before you head to the airport. Then you see what's your you know, airplane, airplane still fly there, and airplane, you know, what's the situation right now, right? All the information you can know, right? And it's a, for use AI, use AI to schedule it, yeah? To do make decision making for, in order to reduce the traffic, reduce the, the congestion, and also for security purpose for each of your passengers. Yeah? And the same thing, we will say next, next, next month, US president, China president meet there. Like, they love to meet this small country, uh, the country, right? In the neutral country, yeah? You company take this security services, what are you going to do? Yeah? They leave that airport, they meet that meeting room. You put all the sensor, everything there and put that one in the digital twin. And uh, we'll monitor everything suspicious, shadow, right? Will be, you know, recognized by AI. Will report to, you know, the, the, the human, yeah? Which they can solve the problem, make sure that there's uh, no any issue for them, right? So this is uh, my solution to uh, this kind of case for future, for digital twin based on the AI, data collection, 5G network, right? Everything can be done right now, yeah? Of course, the drone, yeah? The drone can pedal you about your airport, right? Pedal about your hotel, pedal about the, the interesting facility, right? That's part of the solution, okay? So think of that. So this is a, um, I would, would rec recommend for your team uh, three, for your uh, uh, team project two, you may continue Think of developing some digital tree for airport business, okay. right? There's a video on that one, right? For airport, you know, you can. Now, Hong Kong is the first like country which is uh, using the digital tree in their airports. They are working on it. Yeah, so you, you can learn some of the paper, right? Yes. Then you propose for this case, and then maybe use some of the tools. Uh, now, nowadays it's easy. You can use the chat GPT. <laughs> can help your solution, yeah? <laughs> you can either copy ChatGPT paper, right? But then you use a tool to learn new things, yeah? Use ChatGPT, you know, to do some program for you. So I will uh, give you some idea, right? For your team for that too. So overall, you guys uh, have done a very good uh, presentation, okay? So you need to work a little bit detail. And uh, so uh, audience, please give some feedback for team three. Then you put in a final uh, uh, report, yeah? And I'm going to read it. Make it defend your solution, right? What's the one million dollars consulting fee? No, yeah. We, we, we find it like uh, why we use AI, like because this company is already so big in Singapore right now. They yeah. have they are already working in many AI is huge. Yeah, yeah. That's what, that's what I say. Yeah. Why we use like uh, why we use this one? Yeah. Because this can help to make a new business. Okay, this can be a business for them. They can export like they can sell this business to other countries. Like, uh, so that's why you didn't read the case very carefully. This is a 
This is security. Singapore. 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 Right? Yeah, yeah, and the government have a lot of leverage to this yeah, company, yeah, right? Yeah. That was, this company do a lot of other non-relevant business. Yes. Yeah? Yes. This is a case, right? Yes. The core business is security. 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 But yes. Singapore is, you know, few, like you family business, almost like family business, right? Yes. The government say you do this, something like that, right? They can do it, right? Yeah, yeah. But the core business is their security. Security business. Airport. Airport. If you make it the airport, when it's mostly, you can expand to here tomorrow. Yeah. Vancouver Airport, Toronto Airport, right? Yes. You can outsource that surface, right? So. You don't need too many people, right? It is done by digital tree. Okay. Yeah? Yes. Think about that. Yeah. Yes. Okay. That's a good example. Yeah, they really have capability for AI, not enough. Okay. Yeah? Think about it. Thank you. Okay? Yes. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Good, 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 good. Okay. So we will have uh, team four, right? Who are the team four? Okay, so what's uh, what's the case for the UK? Okay, that, yeah, the, the supply chain. Yeah? So do some research, you know, on the website, all the information, and uh, provide a convincing solution to, to them, right? So this class, a lot of debate about this, this course, right? You, I could teach you, you know, computer. I'm a computer side guy, right? I teach you step by step, right? I don't think you are interested, yeah? Yeah, I want to develop you guys problem solving skill, which is most valuable when you have MBA, work in your industry, right? You have a new idea, right? That is an AI. You can let a tell, tell GPA do it for you nowadays, but what's the idea come from? What's kind of the, What's the question you ask chat to do, right? That's the idea. You cannot ask the right question, right? Chat to do nothing. So. Yeah? So that's why you need a, uh, some quantum thinking, solve the problem, okay? And uh, so I will talk about your team project too, some ideas, right? Maybe you might like use some chat to do it. I'll give you some demo idea. Who have tried the chat GPT? After what? you have submitted something from ChatGPT, how to teach uh, <laughs> digital to the MBA student? I see your post in LinkedIn. Oh, oh you're, you're smart. <laughs> <laughs> Not enough. You really use an idea to learn the business, to learn the money. So you guys in a very interesting time. Okay? So this is just the key. It's about AI. Yeah, it's AI. AI, right? It's AI just something that's so great. And um, this is like the impact of uh, your computer revolution, your uh, low level cloud worker. Yeah? Like your electricity revolution, you know, the physical worker. Also, like uh, iPhone, you know, revolution the computer industry. So, this is a new milestone for you, just during our course, right? So, we must do something for this, uh, for this tool. Yeah, and you will see this is just beginning. There will be a lot of people out of the job. You believe that? Yeah. You a teacher, you cannot teach some knowledge because chat GPT do much better than program. You cannot make money, not money because chat GPT can do it. Yeah, and a lawyer, you cannot make a lot of money chat from there. Chat GPT can do it. Okay. But for you guys, new project, how you suppose to do new business, generate new business? Yeah. So I uh, recommend you for your team project with the right timing. You have three topics. You can use digital tree like airport. Can give you a case solution. Okay. Use some of the tools. Option two. Metaverse, yeah, use a metaverse concept, develop some virtual asset, yeah, and which is a, you know, uh, most typical application for metaverse, okay. Option three right now is a chat GPT. Chat GPT. So you will do some research. Chat GPT, what's can help him idea for business digital transformation. Yeah? 
actually giving the funding. Right? That is the money people have come to it. Yeah, go to end up much work, right? Maybe they put some there. Yeah, the idea is that, right? Now you know that. Okay, do some research, do your own research, more detail, right? As a teamwork. Then set two of them as a mini project. Yeah? To you know, select a one. So one of them say, you know, doing um, online chatbot for customer services. You guys saw this at Amira, right? Amira? Amira the, the, the lady? Amira the lady that's customer service. Have you watched the video? This can be done by ChatGPT very easy. Yeah? You can. Because ChatGPT can do it programming. So you basically connect to your chatbot to ChatGPT by API. Right? Then you do feed your company product information. Right? Then you're able to develop something like a Mula kind of chatbot by itself. Right? Do some very interesting chatbot, right? Because basically you create a special emotion for your custom software. Yeah? And a lot of what I say for my product training online. So how do you sell something, right? You need you know, some training, how to use it, right? How, how to open the box, how to set up, how to you know, troubleshoot it, right? Why it's not working, yeah? So this kind of things can be done by you right now, right? So you can develop some product to show us, yeah? You step the chatbot, develop some program, connect to the chatbot engine. This is developed by OpenAI, yeah? Which I know the company for a long time, yeah? Suddenly, the performance for newer level came so strong. That's why, you know, revolutionary, yeah? And because the idea for open AI, everyone can use it for free. Yeah? But they need a lot of money to train more latent knowledge and more computing power. And also uh, accessible by each of you. You can do that on your PC, right? They need a lot of investment. So right now, they are corp uh, corporate with uh, uh, Microsoft, Azure, Azure, right? And how much did the Microsoft invest? Yeah? It's a big news the last week. 100 billion, yeah? So they integrate this one, chatbot, with Microsoft product first. So eventually, you work, your PowerPoint, right? More smart. Deliver my PowerPoint for my this service case study, right? <laughs> of probably the same good as you, right? Very soon, yeah. And write me find a summary report for this case. <laughs> Where is that? That's why you should not use it, yeah. But very soon, the university has to deal with this, yeah. They already yeah. sent the email actually, uh, saying that uh, using this kind of things. Uh, we can think of like, it's like you can yeah, take right, the right? You cannot use for your uh, assignment, yeah. but we try to do use to problem solving, to do some uh, yeah, programming, true. yeah? And uh, so for you guys, opportunity, right? I'm getting so uh, uh, hyper for nowadays, yeah? Uh, I only sleep four hours per day. Every day I do that, right? You see it on my channel? Yeah, this is good opportunity for you, yeah? Okay, so, great. So you guys work, work, work together, right, right, to improve your final solution report. Yeah? Meaning that what's one million dollar by CEO? If we send you to Singapore tomorrow, right, you will make a presentation the day after tomorrow, they're willing to pay you one million dollar to kind of fee. Yeah? Yes. Yeah? That's about business solution. Business is kind of services. Okay, good. Then you will have one week to submit your final report, okay? You have one, one week to submit your final report. Okay, have you uh, given evaluation for Team 3, please? Yes, yes. Oh, you done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is uh, up to uh, 
40 to 50 percent degree. Have you done that? Okay, I can see who have not done that. Yeah? You want me to spell your name? Do it right now. Okay, so make sure to do that, okay? So now let's uh, have a lecture. That's good, yeah. So I will touch on that. Okay, let's do it. Then we talk about more on the chat. I mean, can give you some demo on chat GPT. Yeah? Yeah? Because I spent too much time. Give me some demo. So basically, it's kind of MIS, you know, called enterprise resource planning software, right? Most, most of the company implement such software, yeah? Walmart, Simon Food, you know, him holding, right? Because the manager there, you know, information and uh, place order and inventory, yeah? And what's, 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 what's likely there, there for the, uh, some customized package from, you know, third party, like SAP, Oracle, yeah? Like uh, Microsoft, right? Or some of them hire some of the, you know, engineer from India, outsourcing to them to develop such system, okay, called ERP. Okay, and um, so basically you uh, uh, make sure this generate uh, uh, some profit and also reduce some cost. The major cost for uh, company IS is probably, you know, the ERP system. Okay, so this has been a long process, yeah, with a computer uh, invention in 1970, yeah. Before they use a mainframe, they have a big system and a long process. Then they have a, a PC-based system. Everybody can develop some of the, you know, inventory, production management, sales, payroll, right? Separate system. Yeah. Uh, most of the systems still uh, in this kind of uh, stage. And now we talk about business process engineering. Yeah. We try to put them together. And uh, now we focus more on this enterprise resource planning on the decision support, which is chat GPT already for you, right? Now you know how to use this one for your company benefit because it's open. Everyone can use it, right? I just think uh, Google can catch up, yeah? How do you train the people so smart? It gives a lot of education, yeah? And uh, once you are in the front, right? But very hard for certain for for catch up. That's why Google lost uh, uh, a stock value. How much they lost last uh, two weeks? Hundred billion. Hundred billion. Same thing as the investor too opening up. Yeah. yeah so is. people, if you try that one, right? You fail, right? You will not use Google anymore. Google is right. Google AI is not good. Yeah, so Google tried to catch up, right? But hard, very hard for this kind of model. So that's why Google will be in trouble. So same thing we're doing this kind of a, a smart ERP, which I'm calling. Uh, this is about history of our ERP progress. So basic ERP, right? So I worked a long time for ERP. When I got my computer science graduate, I worked for Beijing big manufacturers, electronic manufacturer with 4,000 people, right? That time we used the mainframe to develop, uh, you know, uh, called information application, right? And we spent a long, long years on that. I spent five years, very boring, to develop inventory control and uh, production uh, uh, assembly line, yeah? 
It's a it's a original phase of the MIS information system. And uh, so, well, basically, you will support business function, right? Sales, finance, and uh, purchase, HR, CIM, which you guys learn from your each of your subject. The big issue this is implemented by isolated that island. So you make sure you, you know, ERP or MIS to improve your operational efficiency, right? And before you have to check manually your inventory. Now everything on the computer, right? And uh, and you improve decision making, right? Should I order these parts right today? How much parts? How many parts? How much we should pay? Yeah, that is decision making, right? Make your uh, company more competitive. And of course, we use organizational cost, right? If you hire people, easy to make a mistake, also cost you much. Uh, um, what is Question? this ERP? Uh, enterprise Resource Planning. It's a, a lot of words called Management Information System. Okay. Yeah, they call ERP, okay? It's a resource. Oh, so what's typical resource in your company, in any company? Oh, it's, uh, for example, in circuits, uh, Yeah, what's, what, what's the circuits, typical resource in circuits? <coughs> right, the cost for the, for the company. Human. Oh, no, no, no that's, that's yeah, part. Human. Yeah, human resource, yeah. <laughs> and the robot, the drone. Yeah, the drone. Six asset, yeah. The IP, the people have some that's straight that's IP, thing. yeah. And, uh, also, they have uh, all the device, yeah? And uh, all this is a resource, they're planning all the resource, right? So there are a lot of ways to save management information system, right? What's for business? This is a huge resource to make money, right? So in order to make money, you know, either increase the sales revenue or reduce the cost. That's why they were done, it's a resource money called Enterprise Resource Planning System. Yeah. Good question. And uh, how to make that one, uh, your business process more efficient, right? Simplify, simplify. And uh, supply chain, right? You can be able to manage your supply chain. You know, for that's why that why is shortage even in, in Canada, right? The baby tetanum, uh, baby daughter, right? Unfair. What should you do? Right, you go to rush to all the drugstore, no cabinet. Yeah, like that because luckily I got one. Yeah, <laughs> otherwise I'll be crying. Yeah, on favor of the vaccine. So, in order to make that pattern, uh, right, that a lot of chemical component come from everywhere, China, India, you know, uh, from South America, yeah, Mexico, right. Any disruption for that chemical. You cannot produce such pattern, right? So this is a so your computer system ERP should manage each of the key component, right? And make sure you know there's no uh, uh, disruption and uh, improve asset deployment training, right? People development, right? Training people how to use it, and uh, so each of the component, of course, reduce cost. ERP can reduce cost, of course. If you everything done by human Excel, right? It's a lot of cost. Yeah. If you done by software, right? Doing payroll, yeah. And uh, every uh, Friday, every two weeks, right? And midnight, you got paid, yeah. So you know, done by computer. Accuracy. Make sure no mistake for my pay, yeah. And a streamline business process, right? From each of the other HI, uh, supply chain, CIM to decision making, and you want to reduce the cost. Uh, IT were pretty expensive, right? Typically it costs about you know, 5% to 10%, yeah? Some of the company like uh, you know, Google, Facebook, right? Cost probably up to you know, 50%, very costly. So the key thing for now, we need a uh, ERP to make decision, decision making, because we are in a big data period, right? A lot of information overloading. So we basically, you know, we um, monitoring, empowerment, analyze tool, right? We need to collect uh, chemical for the 
such as airport management, we need to collect information about airport, right? The traffic, the, 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 the airplane, the schedule, yeah? the maintenance schedule, right? All the information will be fit in your system, right? Then we use the uh, tools to analyze, right? Before the airplane fly, we should, you know, whether it's in a good shape, right? And make sure, you know, you should not congest each other, right? So the common pitfall is a kind of a misunderstanding cost, and of course change management. Anything you you plan something, right? You want a you know new way to do things, right? There's always some uh, resistance. So that's why you are writing assignment uh, two, change management, right? Will be due on this Sunday, yeah, yeah. And uh, then we talk about benefit realization. So when you are or IT manager or uh, chief of information office, right? Always people are challenging you. What's, what's your value? What's your return? ROI? Yeah? So this is a cost structure about every IT system. Yeah? And you can see very interesting, right? So initial software were only 15%, very small. Yeah? And in particular, you can, you can buy third party from Microsoft, from um, Oracle. Very cheap. However, 12%, now there's even less. You know why? You don't need a hardware or in your, you know, on your facility. You can, you can outsource it to cloud computing. You know, AWS or Zoom. Yeah? You don't pay until you use it. Yeah? Like to watch electricity. And, uh, See, you can see the change management, uh, data conversion, is also 15%. We need to manage the data, yeah, different format. And the change management, most interesting is the 43% of half of the cost on the engineering, yeah, improve your software. Yeah, you can hire somebody or you buy a new package to debug your software, right? So the engineering change management over you know about sixty percent, right? So that is a uh, regular cost for ERP system. So how to make change management, which is uh, you guys discuss in research or not? It's communication, organizational design, training, development, shareholder management. It's part of the change management, and. Um, so when you're doing change, you relate to technology. The new technology, how to train your employee, you manage to do that, right? The new process, yeah? Because new uh, uh, innovation, they have new process to do things. And uh, what's the people? What's the people, right? Some of the people, for example, uh, for certain case, right? A lot of old guys, right? Never know computer. So how to train them, yeah? That's one of the challenges for them, yeah? If they use the technology, yeah? Like you couldn't part doing the you know, bodyguard, how do you train them to do a new uh, AI, right? That's part of the change management. So this is uh, AI, chat GPT, right? Where revolution our society, yeah? Actually, right, you can see that, right? Uh, I know most of the generation Z, you don't have work for the big company anymore. You don't work for yourself. Do you guys? Do you? Yeah? Yeah. So this is give you each person opportunity to create your own business. Right? And uh, so as a leader, for this kind of company, for example, you are a leader for Uber. All this work is not your work. Yeah? It's third party freelance. If you are a leader for Airbnb, all the room is not yours. Yeah? Did you leave?